Good afternoon and welcome to CPTV, the Charlestown Pirate Television Report. It's Thursday, March 31st, and I'm Alante Weathers. And I'm Melissa Crick. Stay tuned for the latest news and information for Charlestown High School. Coming up next. Key Club will have a meeting this Friday, room A102 at 745 a.m. Election qualifications and details will be given. Planning for prom week will be held. The iMovie committee should bring what you have completed. This week is your last chance to buy t-shirts, sweats, and hoodies for the junior class fundraiser. No sales past this Friday. Interested in trying out to be a football cheerleader? Trials are scheduled to be held on March 31st from 5 p.m. to 8 p.m. For more information, please contact Coach LaFountain. The best way to get your announcement on the CPTV report is to have a teacher email it to Mr. Gross. Please get the announcement to us three days in advance. The latest Charlestown weather forecast plus your latest local sports coming up after the break. Good afternoon, I'm Melissa Crick with a look at the Charlestown weather forecast. Tonight, mostly cloudy skies, high 48. Tonight, partly cloudy skies, low 33. Tomorrow, partly cloudy in the morning, increasing clouds with periods of showers later in the day, high <laughs> 54. Chance of rain, 50%. That's a look at your Charlestown weather, and here's the latest sports with Andy Stidham. Good afternoon, I'm Andy Stidham. Here's the latest Charlestown High School sports. The boys and girls track and field team kicked off their season on Wednesday night at Providence. The boys team scored 45 points points and came in second behind Providence and ahead of South Central and New Washington. Scoring at first for the boys were Kaya Sutherland in the 1600 meter run and the 1600 meter relay team consisting of Sutherland, Kyle Jenkins, Sally Sudu and Justin Wolf. Placing second events were Sudu in the 100 meter, Jenkins in the 300 hurdles, the 3200 meter relay team consisting of Jenkins, Sutherland, Noah Bates and Jay Shelley. And the 400 meter relay team consisting of Sudu, Wolf, Luke Woods, and Cesar Hernandez. The girls picked up 42 points to finish third. Scoring first place ribbons for the girls were Jessica Farmer in the 200 and 400 meter runs and Megan Brooks in the discus. Farmer also placed second in the long jump and third in the 100 meter. Brooks placed second in the shot put. Lauren Crow, Allison Stembro, Edeline Gomez, and Sam Smith also ran impressive races to help the Pirates. Both teams will uh, compete again next Tuesday at home against New Washington. And the spring sports season continues this week on Saturday as the Pirate baseball team will see its first action of the year as they host Charlevoix of Michigan at 12 o'clock noon at the Charlestown Little League Park. And that's Look at Sports. A final word from the newsroom is next. Do you have a friend with a birthday coming up? If so, why not say happy birthday in a special way? by putting their pictures on the CPTV report. Simply bring in six pictures and three dollars into room A103 in the business wing anytime between 1126 and 202 p.m. and we'll get that special announcement on the CPTV. Please bring your pictures in at least two days in advance if possible. All right. Now you're up to date with the latest CPTV news, weather and sports. I'm Melissa Crick. And I'm Alante Weathers. Have a great day Pirates and thank you for watching the CPTV report.